I've scammed my dad by giving him a Ferrari, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> <laughs> As you've seen in the main channel video, I gave my dad this Ferrari, but there's still a lot of work that still needs doing to it. The job for today, not for me, for Matt, the cameraman, and my dad, is to crack on and try and get this Ferrari finished, and I think we should have to take it to Ferrari afterwards to get it absolutely finalised. It's over to you two now. It's us! Today we're going to be fixing the Ferrari, which I got scammed with. <laughs> <laughs> Windows don't work, can't lock it, door card's not on, steering wheel's not straight, it's like a Christmas tree on the... Uh... <laughs> on the dashboard. It's too low, the handbrake don't work properly. He has scammed you hasn't he? He's giving yeah. you this car, it just doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> let me out. Let you out? Why, why can't you let yourself out? Connect the electric window up. <laughs> get out that way. <laughs> That's how you have to get out of your Ferrari. Right, as long as it's not raining. Yeah. <laughs> it shouldn't go all the way up, should it? See, look, if you shut the window now... Oh, it's going to break it. It's going to break the glass. So basically, the issue is, is we need to make it so when you close the door, it's, the it's glass will go up, yeah. and then when you open the door, it'll go down. Yeah. Which, motor issue, or...? Uh, switch somewhere, I think. Switch. Yeah, something's got to tell the window that the door's open, so right. it doesn't go all the way to the top, and then when you've shut it, it tells it that it's locked so it can close. Right. You got that? See the switch there? This little micro switch there? Yeah. It's got something to do with that. I don't think it's hitting when it should. Oh, okay. It needs setting up. See you got? Why the window come down? <laughs> if you watch this piece here, yep. hit that. Look what like. So when it hits that, I think it's supposed to stop the window because the door's open. Right. And then when you close oh, it. And then when you close it, the lock indicates that it's closed and then lifts and up. it lifts up so essentially we've got to make that we've got to make yeah. that touch this, this. that yeah which it was doing but was it clicking the switch in what's your thoughts on matt scamming tony with the ferrari <laughs> <laughs> i think he got quite a good deal i don't know what you mean <laughs> you a better job if you'd have known it was yours yeah that's no. a good question <laughs> <laughs> i'd have just took a bit longer to finish it <laughs> regardless of the fact that matt scammed you did you ever think that you were going to be working on your own Ferrari? No, I didn't. No? I don't mind him scamming me, really. <laughs> yeah, because you have got a Ferrari. Do <laughs> you think the switch is broke? Shall we test it? Yes. All it is is a little marker switch. Look, when the window mechanism hits that, I'm assuming it shuts the power to stop the window going to the top. I feel like if that's broke, it could be expensive. What, this? Yeah, because it's Ferrari. Maybe. Don't say Ferrari on it though, does it? No, it doesn't. Could be off like a Volkswagen Passat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it could be. <laughs> <laughs> I can't find our multimeter, but I think the one that I have found, <laughs> look at that, I think it needs testing with a multimeter. <laughs> <laughs> That's from like the 60s, that is. Is that the one you had when you were a lad? No, I found it in the drawer over there. <laughs> I don't know who it is. There you go. That's doing nothing. Oh. Switch perished. Switch very bad. <laughs> yeah. Look, I'm pressing it down to read in nothing. Perished. What was wrong with the old windy windows back in the day? Nothing. No. I think we should get them back, don't you? <laughs> in this case, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, Matthew, we found out <laughs> the problem with the window and we've ordered the switch. Okay, so now we've got to move on to the next job, which is this, at the minute, is my handbrake. <laughs> we have to do that. <laughs> so every time you drove this car, you've then had to do that afterwards? I have, yeah. I have to keep my foot on the brake, Karen has to jump out, Get the wood, put it under my wheel. <laughs> <laughs> because this doesn't exhaust. My lovely son who gave me this beautiful vehicle yep. broke it. How did you do that? 
don't know, maybe it was his biceps after the gym. Or oh, something. yeah, he has been going gym on yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> Seat out, centre console out. Let's fix the handbrake. Seats coming out, four bolts, two at the front and two at the back. Even you could do this, Matthew. Wow, <laughs> violating me. I'm just here to film you. <laughs> <laughs> do you want me to do this one? Can you do it? Yeah, I'll do it. Go on then. Do you want to do my job? Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, come here then. If that's dead easy, I might get her an achy arm. <laughs> 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 Whose job is easier? <laughs> Yours. <laughs> <laughs> Switch job, there, there you go. go. There you go, mate. Let's swap. Right. <laughs> Okay, good old, look at that, he's been doing good. You know what? What? We've got two seats to take out. Right. At the minute, we're only going to get one out today. <laughs> Give me my camera back. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm going to stay behind the camera. <laughs> there you go. Do you always leave this attached when you take your... <laughs> Cameraman barrier. <laughs> <laughs> You shall not pass. <laughs> Do you want to take the other seat out? I'll take the other seat out. Go on then. So Matt used to tell me that he used to go out and mark each bolt that he had to undo and then leave him to it and he had to undo all those bolts and to come out and tell him the next thing to do back when he was younger when he was a kid. Oh, Is that true? Maybe. Maybe? Do you not remember? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm working on the car. Why? Here's Hannah Lott. Come to I'd help. do a better job. Wow! I have got been here for two minutes! Dad, I need your help. I oh, know you do. Go on, get I've out undone the, the four bolts, but I can't get the electric <laughs> <laughs> Trying to show off doing it blind. Done it! I loosened you. <laughs> no, you didn't. See out. There you go. I'm taking the knob off. It's jammed up this morning. What do you mean because somebody up? hadn't fitted it properly. That little <laughs> nut there, that went, that fell down there like that. What? And I couldn't get it. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, it jammed down there. And I couldn't select the gear then. Look, you see that? Why has it been cut? Cut, isn't it? It's cut, it, cut a bit out. Maybe to loosen it, was it? This is from my favourite track experience company. That's so. it, yeah, maybe that, yeah. We're not saying that it's my son or anything. No. No, he would never do anything like that. I don't think he would. I he think wouldn't. that's a track experience company thing. I think it is. Yeah, okay. I think you're all 100% <laughs> on that. <laughs> What's that there? It's a horse. Oh, yeah. Why is it a horse? Because it's a Ferrari, isn't it? <laughs> is that bolt on my side or your side? <laughs> well, let's have a look from the top to see which side it's on. Oh, is it yours? <laughs> <laughs> oh, can't get that out. Do you want me to get that out? No. How did he break this? I think it's ready to lift. Oh, oh! I thought it just tilts up. Is it? Yep, yeah, there you oh, go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that! Oh. oh, perished. <laughs> <laughs> How did he break that? Oh my God. He must have pulled it well off. He it there. He's pulled it out the car. <laughs> That's quite impressive. <laughs> <laughs> he really wanted to stop the car, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> Look, he's literally so. snapped it from that mount there. From there and there. <laughs> Where? There. Oh my. <laughs> New handbrake. Look at that. That's what it's supposed to look like with those lugs on. Yeah, it's a bit different. This one's better than your last one. It is. Do you know why? Because it's got some yellow stitching on that don't go with the red. <laughs> 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 but never mind. You don't really see that because it's underneath, isn't it? I think this is better for handbrake turns. Well, yeah, it will be because this one works. <laughs> <laughs> pin out. Always use a new split pin. Look at that! Oh, look at that! Oh, oh put that on there. New split pin, look at that! Look at that! Look at that. Done. This is going to be great. I'm actually going to have a handbrake. Bolt going in! Bolt in! See how quick I did that? Second bolt in, talk to spec. First bolt, talk to spec. Oh, it comes up a long <laughs> way, doesn't it? <laughs> You pull it up while I push it. Push me. It's heavy. <laughs> oh no. You know why it won't push? <laughs> Not the wood in. <laughs> right, now let's see if the rear handbrake works. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> Did you almost fall over? <laughs> I think that worked. It goes pretty high. 
Oh, it does when you pull it up. Look at that. <laughs> right, that's it. Fixed. We've got new bits, new switch. Wow. New door lock. Did you buy them or did Matt? Matt's bought these. Oh, so he's unscammed you? Not yet. Because <laughs> <laughs> it might not work. <laughs> I'm just putting this switch on to the motor. It's on. Yeah. Radio's on. You know what? That's the only speaker that works in the whole car. That? <laughs> yeah. That little thing is all you've got to listen to the radio. <laughs> Does it work? Moment of truth. Oh, it, you know why it did work? It's not plugged in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Worked! Oh. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Ferrari technician! <laughs> <laughs> oh wow! It moves a long way, doesn't it? Yeah, it, it's not perfect, but it works. Yeah, we've got to line it up now, haven't we? Matthew, I've adjusted the window. Now look, when you shut the door, see how the glass lines up? That is a lot beautifully. better. Beautifully. But, yeah. but, you haven't seen the best bit yet. Right. <laughs> Show me, I'm excited. <laughs> because... <laughs> <laughs> Why is it done that? That's what happens. That's the best I can get. Is it. that even sealed? Yeah, it's sealed. It but, is sealed. But like, that's crazy. It's like perfect, and then it goes. Perfect there. And <laughs> it pushes it over. <laughs> but I'm happy with that door card. Door card's going on. Do you like the door card? Anyway, today's job is to sort this steering out. When you're going straight. The car thinks it's going to the right. <laughs> what, that's straight on the steering wheel? That's straight there. Yeah. Wow. Well, I've checked the track rod ends first. Yeah. To make sure that there's an equal amount of thread on each side of the track rod ends. And is there? And there is. So what's causing the steering wheel to look like that? The column's not been put on right. We're fitting this as well. It's a steering <laughs> angle sensor. Look, what happens is, you're not supposed to move this until it's in, but when you steer, that turns lock. That will tell the car that it's going in a straight line. Right. Under here, look. Yeah. See the column? This column here. Yeah. Where it connects to there, that's the steering wheel up there, that way. We've got to move that on its splines around. Too old for this. Oh, my back. <laughs> <laughs> like that. Oh. oh. Is that an extra bit? <laughs> you know what they're for? See them bits there? Yeah. If you have an accident, that collapses yeah, rather than it going through the steering wheel coming through you. More you know. Yeah. There we go. There it is. The old one. Someone took that apart and marked it with red paint when it was in the upright lot. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> well, we'll put this one back on. Yeah. Clipped in. Is that straight? Um. Don't say relatively. Relatively? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Works. Are you going to confront your son on the fact he scammed you? <laughs> <laughs> no. This whole video you've no, been saying You're just trying to you. cause trouble. No, you've you? been saying he scammed you. <laughs> well, he sort of scammed me. <laughs> <laughs> it was a nice scam. A nice scam. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't wait to be nicely scammed. <laughs> it's like being scammed on the internet, but somebody gives you money. <laughs> <laughs> Next job, make it so we can see that he's got a tire on. <laughs> you do that by adjusting these, and that's the locking nut that's done up, look. <laughs> and we've got to wind that up. It makes this part of the shocker longer. If you do know, want to know how to do these, I'm sure Google will tell you. <laughs> see you later. After hours of winding, you can now see the tire. Look at that. That fits perfect, I reckon. Yeah. Now it's the right height, I'm gonna take Matthew, my best cameraman, oh, no. out with me <laughs> for a drive. Are you gonna let me drive it? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds so good. <laughs> She's been 
your baby. It's your baby. <laughs> <laughs> Is the steering wheel straight now? Look at that! Oh, beautiful! Out of ten, what do you rate the Ferrari? Well, it's gonna be a ten. A ten? It's gonna be, isn't it? So is it done? Yeah, sort of, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so the lights that are on the dash, I think, is all to do with the EDF, the suspension and the brakes, and it's all connected. And I think we're gonna need a specialist Ferrari tool to get them off. Does it still have the engine management light come on? Yeah. It still has the engine management light come on. And that was to do with a cam variator sensor. More sensors, more electrics, which is the bane of the car. But at least the, the engine's running and there's no oil leaks, which is good news, and it can be driven. But I think the next trip is definitely to Ferrari to see if we can get all of these lights out. Then it goes to the body shop. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, hit the subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button, and I'll see you over on the main channel. Peace out.